My dear brothers and sisters, I am a living testimony of the goodness of God, of God's amazing grace, of His mercies that are really just so tender but new every morning. I am a miracle of God. I am a walking miracle of God. You know, some of the things that I went through, even just physically, you'd think, how is she able to manage to do all the things she's doing? Only by the grace of God. Only by the grace of God. And then I had my three cesareans, or even before that, I had a cyst at my back that had to be operated on. And then in 1996, I was diagnosed to have malignant thyroid cancer. My kids were very young at that time. The youngest, if I'm not mistaken, was six. I mean, I don't want to do the computation right now, but about that time. And he was, his, his teacher told me that he was just always walking around the classroom. So I had to talk to him and sit him down and tell him, you know, ask him, what's, what's wrong? What's the matter? And then he said, Mama, they said, you're sick. And then I said, yes, so do you know what I'm sick of? Do you understand? Yes. Cancer? He went like that. Then he looked at me and then I said, do you know what cancer means? And he said, that you're gonna die. And my heart broke. Even now as I recall it and see his face, I can see his face. All of a sudden as he said that, his tears dropped. Then I just hugged him and said, but God can heal me, son. And guess what? Truly, God healed me. I did not go through chemotherapy. I didn't have to go even through radiation. It was a choice. I said, if I had radiation at that time, I would be separated from my children um, for about, I think, two weeks. I'm not sure anymore at the exact time that I would be away from them. And I, don't, I, I couldn't bear thinking that I would be away from my children, especially my youngest son, for two weeks because I knew it was really going to just freak him out. Okay, and what was the eighth surgery? 